What's up, my friend? Welcome back to another Kajabi video. So today we're going to take a look at how you can build your own membership and community in Kajabi. So I'm going to show you my backend, show you how things are set up, and then you can apply that immediately for yourself as well when you jump on Kajabi. So uh, first of all, this is a look at my course backend. You can see that I have 13 products currently, and two of those products are being taken up by my membership and my community. So uh, these are completely separate products in the Kajabi system, but to the customer, they're going to be be treated as one product altogether with just two separate components. Okay. So let me show you how this works. Um, when you create a new product in general, this will bring up the, um, you know, the, the options that you can create. So you can create a course, you can create a podcast, a community or coaching. Now you notice there's no option for membership. And the reason for this is because we're actually going to treat the membership area as a regular course. And let me show you what that means. So when you click course and you click get started, they're going to give you options for course title, description, upload a thumbnail, the pricing and everything like that. And so I've already done that for my membership, right? And uh, let me show you the back end of what this actually looks like. So here we are, you can see I have a, a ton of different offers for it, which just means the pricing options. And then I have 79 customers. And uh, yeah, these are all the core components. So the reason why I treat this as a course is because every single month, I'm basically uploading a new piece of content to the, the membership area, which essentially is like a course. Because if you think of an online course, all it really is, is just a bunch of pre-recorded videos that you're hosting on that product. So a membership really is no different. You're just uploading a bunch of stuff to the membership area. And then every single month, you're uploading a, a new core training, PDFs, um, you know, the, the live coaching call replays, you're uploading that all to this membership area. And so uh, it's really flexible in that regard. It's like an ongoing product that gets updated each month, which is really, really nice. So here I have a section for my monthly masterclasses, uh, my track feedback corner, which is exclusive to my community, the composing stages. So I have a success path, the live call replays, which are, you know, all the coaching calls. And then I have a member spotlight. So people who are super um, integrated with the community, super encouraging and very supportive. Those are the people I shout out. And then I have a couple bonus courses here as well. But uh, let me quickly show you under the customized tab what this looks like. So the actual theme or template I have installed here is a third party one. It's called the membership and it lit, it's, it's, a, it's a theme by Kajabi experts. I don't think it's currently hosted anymore by Kajabi, but because I purchased it before Kajabi made their template changes, it's still available to use in, in my backend. But anyway, um, this is an external Kajabi theme and I can customize it any way I like, right? So if I go to customize, you know, I have all these elements that we just took, took a look at on the left side, and then you can go through, change up the links, change up the, the image, right? And um, yeah, you can, you can just affect this any way you like, and you can add new columns here as well, things like that, and new rows. Um, so yeah, that, that's basically how you build the membership area itself. It's like, it's just a regular online course, but you're going to be updating it each month with new stuff. And that's really the main difference between that and a new course. Um, the community aspect again is a separate product. And so if we take a look here, instead of clicking course, you're actually going to click community. And so they call this an access group for the new Viably community, but um, basically this is the place where you want you to dump your members into when they purchase in addition to the course area or the membership area as well. And so you can have a ton of settings here, but I'm just going to show you the way I have mine set up. But uh, basically those are two, those two are integrated together at the same time. But again, they are treated as two separate products. So let's take a look here at my offers because this is actually where I'm going to be giving my options to pay for my membership. So let's, if we take a look here, we have Chris's Composing Community, which is my membership. I have a monthly plan I, and I have an annual plan. So for example, if I have 19 bucks a month, then I times 10, 190 per year. And they, so essentially they get two months free for the annual plan, right? So they can choose whichever one they want. But now if we took a look in this specific offer, you can see here, I've included both the membership product and the community product in this offer, which means that as soon as they pay and check out, so they, let's say they pay for the monthly plan, then they are going to be granted both of these products right away. So they have access to both the membership and the community in their backend as soon as they log into your website. And so that's, that's really cool. Okay. Um, so this is the monthly plan. If we take a look at the annual plan, it's the same thing. It's 190 per year, but they have... Uh, both of those products that are granted as soon as they purchase. And then down here, I have, you know, a thank you email. Thank you so much for joining. You'll have a blast. If you created your account already on the checkout page, then check your email for login details and they can certainly do that. 
And then right after um, they purchase, I have a couple automations as well. Um, so I subscribe them to another email sequence, like a thank you email sequence, but also like a pitch for another product and things like that. Okay. And finally, let me just quickly show you what this looks like from the customer's view. So let's take a look at a preview of the membership itself. So as soon as they log in, this is what they see. I have a welcome page with a landing, uh, welcome page with a landing page, I should say. And um, it has a video that welcomes them. So I kind of talk, um, talk about the membership, show them all the way through, give them sort of like a tour. Right under that, I have a community, which is the community product. And I link that specifically straight to the community product. Again, this is the old Kajabi community, but if you build your uh, community now, you're gonna have access to the Vibely community, which has a lot more functionality. And then here you can see there's all these different topics and stuff like that they can share under, and then the general feed as well, where they can post anything they like, okay? And then the live coaching call, which basically shares the call for the month, click here to join. Um, this month's call is on whichever day and what time, and then if you can't make it, just leave a question uh, under the post, and then they can do that here as well. And then again, under that, I have my monthly master classes, which are the core trainings, so they can click on anyone they like, they can view it, and then leave comments as well. So yeah, that's basically it. And then again, as I have more content, I just upload it into the area. And yeah, I, I really like the opportunity to jump into the community whenever they want, just by clicking that open a new tab so they don't quit themselves out of the membership area. And if they want to go back to the membership, then they can always click this link here to go back to the membership area over here. And that it's as easy as that. So just making sure that you integrate your membership and community together into your offer, making sure that they get access to both immediately after they sign up is really important because if you don't have those two included in your offer, then they're just going to receive one and then you don't want to have to manually give them access to the community, for example, right? So you want to give them options or access to both right away. Make sure that um, you're, you're creating them as separate products on your Kajabi backend so that you can upload them, uh, upload content to the membership separately and then tend to your community separately. It's, uh, it's two products in general, but it's also integrated as one complete product in the customer's perspective, which is really nice. Okay. So hopefully that gives you a little bit of an insight into the technical aspect behind the Kajabi community and membership. Again, if you want to try out Kajabi for yourself and build your membership and community on the platform, again, it's super robust and it gives me actually, uh, honestly, anything that I need, everything that I need. It's really, really useful and really fun to play around with. So if you want to try for yourself, I want to give you that extended 30 day free trial. They give you 14 days on their website. But if you use my link below ChristopherCU.com slash Kajabi, you can take advantage of that 30 day free trial. And I'll give you those two bonus mini courses, absolutely free Kajabi in 30 days and content marketing for creatives to really just help you kickstart your online business as quickly as possible and understand the Kajabi platform as quickly as possible as well. And of course, if you become a paying member of Kajabi, then part of your payment supports me and the channel. So it helps me make more videos like this. Of course, there's no obligation, but just so you know, you can take advantage of that extended trial if you like using my link below. I appreciate it. I'll catch you in the next video and I'll see you very soon. Take care.